good morning, good morning. I am here um, getting ready to do another speaking engagement. <laughs> She's a public speaker, y'all. Um, I'm back here in the green room. First of all, let me tell you how up and coming I am. I'm in a green room. Let me show you. Beautiful seating for all of us. Once everybody else gets here, right? And then on top of the seating, we got snacks, tea, graham, not graham crackers, uh, granola bars, fruit. That's it. All the drinks you could possibly want. And we're getting some hot water going for some tea. Y'all better watch out. The man with the vision. The man with the authority. One to the day. Dr. Conley, but also one of our dear sisters, Akila Jacquet, who is now alumni of Cal State University, Long Beach, and serves on committees, boards there, and has been an ambassador and advocate for so many. Would you please welcome Dr. Jane Conley, as well as Akila. It's us, a college graduate, from Cal State Long Beach, Akila Jaquette. Good morning, Antioch. Do we not go to the greatest church in the world? Like, our church is amazing. So my name is Akila Jaquette. Um, some of you may know me as the very enthusiastic greeter outside on first and third Sundays. But today I stand before you as an alumni of California State University Long Beach. Long Beach. Go Beach. Go Beach. Thank you. So it was a Super Sunday, just like this one. Um, back in 2018, we were over on Gundry still, and someone came and spoke about Cal State Long Beach. And I was sitting there and I'm listening, and I was like, huh, I want to go to that school. So I was very excited. I went back and I told one of my classmates, this is where I'm going to go. And he said, oh, you'll never get in there. Excuse me? So he told me that Cal State Long Beach, the College of Business was an impacted program, and I didn't have any extracurricular activities or anything to make my application kind of stand out to get accepted. And I said, oh, you don't know my God. So I let him go on, I let him talk, let him speak his piece. But one thing I know for sure and something I hold very close to my heart is that with God, all things are possible. So I applied to and got accepted at Cal State Long Beach into their College of Business program. So being at Cal State Long Beach, I had the most amazing experience. It was far more than anything that I could have expected. But at the same time, that's the way God moves in my life. It's like he hears my prayers and he says, here, baby. So I went ahead, I went, and it wasn't just the, the professor that gave me this incredible experience because I did need them and when I struggled academically. They were wonderful. But it was also the experiences I had outside of the classroom. I got the opportunity to meet, meet and bond with a lot of our black faculty and staff some of who are here today. They really helped me during 2022 when I was going through probably the roughest year of my life. They supported me, they held me up, and it was so necessary. They also pushed me to do some things kind of outside of my comfort zone. So while at Cal State Long Beach, I ran for and won the Senator for the College of Business. I restarted the Black Alumni, I'm sorry, the Black Business Students Association. And I was the student speaker at Black Graduation. Because of my experience and my degree from Cal State Long Beach, I am now the special assistant for the uh, LA Council Member of District 15, Tim McCosker.
So while I'm up here, and since they gave me the mic, um, let me also offer a little bit of encouragement. There may be some of you have been thinking about or thinking about going or thinking about going back to college. Allow me to tell you that there is still time. That school is still there. They have space for you and they will accept you. You just have to take that first step and apply. Now, as you're getting ready to do this exciting thing, you may come against some people who are doubters, who are naysayers, but let me tell you what helped me. No matter what negativity came my way, I always remembered that they don't know my God. <laughs> 